So for today's video, I did this cute, um, very simple eye makeup look. I my eyes are watering because my allergies are killing me today. But um, I did this very simple eye makeup look for glasses. Um, specifically designed for people who wear glasses, no false lashes, just a little bit of mascara, very neutral, and then a pop of mauve nudie lip. And then I, of course, wear my natural hair. W weird. I wear my natural wore my natural hair for this as well. So if you're interested in seeing how I got this look, then just keep watching, and don't forget to subscribe before you leave. So I started this tutorial with the brows and other than that I'm completely bare faced and I'm going to go in with the LA Girl Pro Conceal um, concealer to set the eyes as a base. Not set the eyes, prime the eyes as a base. For this I'm using my Morphe MB9 brush to do this with. Then we're going into the Morphe Fall into Fall. Fall, blah, 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 fall into frost palette and I'm going to use this frosty shade to set that concealer and brighten up the eye area. For this I am using the M173 brush. Then we're going into this tan shade as a transition shade. I'm going to take my Morphe M521 brush and just blend that into the crease area. Then I'm going into this coffee colored shade and I'm going to take my Morphe, uh, Morphe E28 brush. Why can I not talk today? I'm going into that color and blending that to deepen the crease. Then I am going into a little bit darker grayish colored shade with my Morphe M411 brush and we're going to put that on the outer corner and blend it into the crease. So going back into that palette, I'm picking up this goldish shimmery shade and my Morphe M B19 brush and I'm going to put this on the inner two thirds of the eyelid space. Then I'm going to curl my lashes using my Tarte eyelash curlers and get those ready for mascara. We're not going in with falsies today because this look is especially for people with glasses. So we're just going to coat those lashes with mascara. And yeah, that's what we're doing. And you can go in with any of your favorite mascara. Um, for this look, I'll use the Maybelline Colossal Lash Mascara. Um, it does make the lashes pop, but I did notice a little bit of residue on the lashes, so I kind of had to filter that out with my fingers. But it is a pretty good mascara, and it did make the lashes pop. So I found this on a day when my allergies were totally kicking my butt, hence the Rudolph the Red Nose Reindeer look I got going on there. Um, but anyway, I took the Maybelline, no, sorry, CoverGirl Super Sizer Mascara to the bottom lashes because I like that wand a little bit better for my bottom lashes and just gave those a nice big coat. I also wanted my eyebrows to be a little bit different and quirky for this video, so I added a little bit of reddish tint to those. Um, up close it looks a little sketchy, but when you look from afar it actually gave it a pretty tone, especially when I added this mauve color to the lips. I'm using one of the eyeliner pencils um, from Wet n Wild in the color... Mm, Gone Burgundy. And I'm just overlining just a little bit to give that pouty look. Then I went in and added my new Kiss Me Lipstick liquid lipstick called Venice from Live Glam. And I really like the way this went with the eye look. I really like this color. Um, I think it's perfect for spring and it went well with the tone of my eyebrows. So yeah.
Then I dabbed a little bit of powder on the lips just to set that color and I went over it with a gloss. I used the NYX Butter Gloss in Fortune Cookie just to make that look a little more shimmery. So thank you for watching. As always, give this video a big thumbs up and I love you guys. See you in my next video.